Welcome to this new video. In this video, we are going to see a use case and the solution for it. The use case or the problem is that from this table, you need to find out the sales unit total and the sales dollar total. So when we see like this, you might think that okay, the sales dollar total should be around 700, but that is not the case. It should be with respect to the pin. And when you consider this pin and the sales dollar is getting duplicated two times, so the ultimate sales order total should be this 200 plus this 50 that should 250 it should not be 700 the same way sales unit as per the pin it should be two because for abc it is one and for pqr it is one so it should be two and here the sales order dollar should be 250 so how you can do that so if you simply take a card visual and if you place it you can see you will be getting it as 700 dollars but that is not the case you have to do it with respect to the pin you can use simply distant and write it because if the pin number gets changed for the next item if the next item is slr and if the sales dollar is 200 still it will be taking only one to one or it the it won't consider the pin number for it so what we can use it here is to build a temporary summarized table and then add the column add the sales column so what summarize does is it returns a summary table for the requested total over a set of groups. So we are not going to create a table for it. Instead of that, we are going to create a variable and you are going to assign this summarize table to that variable. So in this summarize table, we are going to give this table name and group by we are going to group by pin and the name we are going to give is sales and the expression is distant of this sales order. So with respect to this group by pin, so distant of this ABC will be 200 and distant of this PQR will be 50. So we'll be assigning that to a variable. So we'll be getting a table with two columns. One will be for pin ABC and next column will be for sales dollar. And in the next step, you just need to sum this sales dollar column. So it will be 250, it will be so If you sum it, it you will be getting 250. So we will see so as mentioned we are having the table we are having the pin number abc and pqr and sales unit everything is one and sales dollar is also shown as mentioned so this is the table problem table so now we will create a measure for it so first right click and do new measure so first we are going to do is we will get the sales dollar with respect to the pin so what we can do is we will write it as total sales because we can create a variable variable summarize sales still you can use the summarize method summarize the table we are going to give this table problem and the next one is group by we are going to group by so we are going to group by problem pin so we are going we are going to take group it with respect to this column and the column pin we are going to group and we will be giving a name as sales and the next one is the expression we are going to get the distance of this so we need only one two hundred so for that we are going to get the distance distance of sales dollar so this will be the so when you so now you have created a temporary column temporary table which is having a pin column and a distant sales column so in this temporary table we will be seeing only two rows one row will be abc and 200 and the next row will be pqr and 50. so now we can return the statement and we can next now we need to add the two columns of sales in this temporary table so you can use sumx and the table is summary sales you can give the column name sales that's it so we will create a visual for showing this so you can take the card visual and you can select the total sales now we got it just 250 correctly you can give the dollar symbol also so now we need to get the sales unit with respect to the pin and the same way as we have found the total sales we can find the total sales unit also you can right click and create the measure and the measure name will be total sales unit equals and create a variable whereas units equals to summarize function and the problem table we need to give and then we can once again group it by pin and you can give it as units and distant unit with respect to the pin and so you can give it as sales unit now we can return and we can show it as sum x table will be summarize units and the column will be units and copy and paste the same 
here to units and we can take away this total sales and we can place the total sales unit and of course we got this total sales unit as too so if you in other ways if you are simply taking a card and if you are simply placing the sales unit you will be getting five instead of two so instead of this you can create a DAX and you can create a temporary table using summarize method and you can use the distance function with respect to the summarize column and then we can add that distance function column. So in this way you can solve this problem. This problem I got from Facebook and hope this will help you. Have a nice day.